guys, what is going on? And today we're gonna be talking about my math class, like I said in my ELA, my crazy ELA class video. So basically, my teacher was out like on fraternity leave or something, so we had to substitute. We'll name him. I don't know. We'll, we won't give him a name, I guess. So basically, what you would do is like, there's this kid in my class. It's Bill from the uh, ELA video. He would like get like he would get in trouble for just like shouting something out loud or something. And she's like. This is your last warning. And he got like 20 last warnings and she still didn't do anything. And we kind of created like a running joke where it's like, This is your last warning, guys. Because she never did anything. Like, I don't know if she could give us a detention or anything, but she never did anything like that. And for the homework, like, my teacher right now, she does, like, she'll check your homework and say, Oh, yep, you did it all. And then, like, tomorrow she'll say, oh, yeah, it was missing. I was like, uh, what? And she's like, oh, it wasn't done whenever I checked it. And I was like, I haven't done anything from it then. It's like, that happened to my one of my friends twice. Happened to me once. Happened to another kid I know. Or one of my other friends once. And happened to another one of my friends, I'm pretty sure, once. It's like, she does this in, like, we're going to this part of the year where we have to not have any missing assignments or anything. To go on this, uh, field trip to, like, a skate park or something. Because, like, we all get a field trip each year. So, like, the 6th graders go to a skating rink. 8th graders go to, like, Six Flags or something like that. And we get to go to a skate park. So, like, we, we don't want to mess that up. Because, like, these are pretty nice days. Because we don't have to do anything at school. And if you do mess it up, and you have to come to school. And you're basically screwed. Because you have to stay at school and just do homework and stuff. So, like, this teacher gives us another missing assignment. I have these little passes where, like, I... So if you have like a 3.0 or higher or something like that, or I don't know, but if you have like that every quarter, then you get like these little certificates where you can like skip the lunch line or and get a late in homework. And I've already used one, but I have one more left. So if she does it again, I can use that because she said it was missing and I showed it to her and she said it was late. I was like, come on. And then the substitute, she would say, as long as it's turned in by the lesson test, which was like three weeks. I have a lesson that she taught us because like we had to go through like nine lessons for the test so she was better with that and she was okay like one time she heard us talking about some like weird stuff i can't remember exactly what it was like she was sitting right behind us but she didn't say anything like I, it was kind of weird because there's some pretty weird stuff and she still doesn't say anything about it like i'm not going to go into details of that if you want me to i can dm you it or something if you want but seriously, like, this, my teacher I have now, she just only yells at the boys and stuff. And there's this one girl in my class that literally, she'll just go behind Bill and just blow her nose really loud. And, like, I think he said that snot got on his back or something one time. And he yells at her because he's mad. And he's like, P please stop or something like that. And he, he, my teacher says, go in the hallway to him. I was like what? This should be the girl that goes in the hallway. Like, he didn't do anything. And then she was saying uh, something about eating breakfast, and she was, like, naming some breakfast, and then he said, like, uh, I can't remember, he said, like, Lucky Charms or something like that. And she yelled at him for saying that and said, if you do that one, uh, one more time or something like that, you'll get a t detention. I was like, what the heck? What kind of cruel path class is this? Like, this is totally opposite from my ELA class. Like, what the heck? Like, she doesn't know how to grade any of the work. Like, my old teacher was a good teacher. Like, my uh, substitute was a better teacher. Like, And also, if you know these teachers, do not come with them their names down below. That's invasion of privacy and stuff like that. But seriously, like, some of these teachers are just crazy. I don't know. But anyway, guys, that's probably going to be it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys later. Peace out.